now I'll show you how we'll create our foundation okay so our pet foundation or isolated foundation to create foundation I'll go on create and from here I'll go footing and there are two types strip footing and pet footing I'll use that option pet footing okay now uh, after that I can before creating footing uh, if I simply click here footing will create but before that I prefer to click here properties now we can see our footing size so what will be the footing size at 72 inch into 72 inch okay and if you need to change that size also we can do that and here materials type uh, or concrete materials 3000 psi concrete materials here available so actually in our another lecture i'll show you about how we'll change your that materials property clear after that i'll click ok and uh, here class i mean the color you can change its color actually as per your requirements so i'll take that class one and after that um, i'll just simply click here to create our foundation here or here if i just click here then expand just see here we have created our foundation if you see here we have created our foundation and you can see here this is available now here and the question is here is your point and some below it's have created our foundation so what is the issue of it okay so what is the issue here I'll uh, discuss about it now uh, skip and after right click interrupt and double click here again after interrupting now at how much below we need that data okay how much below we need that data and what should be the size of pudding we can change also so by clicking here you can also change or you can also take your materials property no problem and here you are seeing the size and i'll just close it simply i will provide here actually has the profile 72 feet into 72 feet size column okay now if i just come here actually how much below we need our foundation okay so if you just provide here zero zero if you provide here zero zero and click here now if you see if you just move it okay this is our top level for our top level if i just close it and again double click and here you can see the bottom size okay so at how much distance below it will create okay at how much distance below it will create so if you provided three if you provide three and if you click here in modify it will also move top and uh, they have some option vertical horizontal top and bottom okay so uh, as usual i will just i will skip i'll right click i'll interrupt and i'll double click here so i'll just provide here two feet depth and its bottom size that will that will be up actually uh, at two feet depth and at bottom size that will be four feet and six inches. so what will be the depth of our that uh, footing that will be i mean uh, depth of our footing it will be two feet six inches. clear two feet six inches and two feet below and if you just provide here three feet three feet below and if you provide here five feet or if you provide here 
uh, 4 feet 6 inch that that means it will create a 18 inch depth or 1 feet 6 inch depth foundation after that apply just see you can see here this value is available clear actually this is the issue that we can i mean how can we create our that foundation so after that and also if you need to move that in top now here uh, if you provide here two feet and also if we provide here for three okay three feet six inches then modify just see it will go top in this way you can change its foundation size or the movement of that foundation clear so if you need to move that foundation in any direction so here vertical direction in vertical direction if you need to move that i mean if you need to design a eccentric eccentric foundation or footing then you can use that option and if you need to rotation if you need to rotate then also you can do that so i'll not use that option at this time i'll show you in another lecture then how we can do that after that i'll i'll just take it three feet depth three feet depth and the size will be our one feet five inch okay so actually this is the depth and from that depth this is the point of our this is the top point of our foundation and uh, bottom this is the bottom level of our foundation so what will be the total thickness of it from that value to i mean the if i subtract that value from uh, that value then it will be i mean from bottom to top we have to subtract or we have to minus then it will be the thickness of our footing clear so when it's done after that i'll simply click modify now it's done so in this way we'll create our foundation now now i'll show that how we'll create columns as per our requirement okay and also if you need to change that size if you need to change that size then right click interrupt and double click here and from here actually if i need a, as a four feet by four feet or five feet by five feet uh column says then i'll provide here 60 inch into 60 inch sorry 16 into 16 column size and i'll just click here and modify then our column size will change okay and if i just click here you can see your value 16 into 16 or with my height and width both are 16 into 16 now i'll just close it 